This is going to be a mini general collective oracle reading if it's meant for you. It's meant for you. Okay, the worry beads. What are you worried about today? What's on your mind? What's on your heart? Potential or challenge? Chocolate. Chocolate makes everything feel better. But this is about love. This is romance, affection, even perfection. Are you worried about being perfect? Are you worried about love? Let's see. What should you focus on today? You have a decision. Are you in the old? Are you in the new? And you know what I just noticed? Those first two cards, they're number nine cards. Nines are about solitude, searching your soul on the brink of a major change. And which direction do you plan on going on? Let's see. Recent past, the labyrinth. You've been lost and you've been trying to find yourself. You've got to sort it out, whatever it is. Now, strength position, another number nine card. Strength, courage, stamina to push yourself forward. Near future, within a few weeks. Hmm. Okay, well, we know the near future is within a few weeks, but the suggested approach, you're here to play chestnut checkers. There's no lateral moves here. You're not going left, you're not going right, you're not going backwards, you're going only forwards. What do you need to know? You're a phoenix. Death and rebirth, total transformation. Uh, another number nine card, all nines. Interesting. Hope and or fear, stop crying over spilled milk. You're worried you're going to be disappointed. You're worried you're going to be sad. Just because you've been hurt in the past does not mean you'll be hurt in the future. And your probable outcome? Interesting. Meditation, yoga, contemplation, basically going within. You might even need to take a break in general. But once you do, get up and go and open yourself back up. 